back in 1991, what, 30 years ago? 3-0? Zero, 3-0. Three, zero, 30 years ago, I'm down in Tennessee, 1991, and uh, I get off work, and I'm extra hungry. So I decided to go to a KFC. It's right off of the University of Tennessee property. I think technically it's still on the property, but it's at the, it, they call it the strip. It's at the end of the strip. I mean, it's, it's not a dead end, no. It just it goes off to the interstate, but it's at the end of their property line. Anyway, I'm craving a chicken dinner. Now, at KFC, Kentucky Fried Chicken, I've always just got the box, you know, what, well, they come in 10 piece or whatever, you know, usually I was with family or somebody, we'd get a big box. I can make a meal just from their fried chicken alone, but anyway, I decide for one time, I'm going to get me a, you know, KFC is not cheap, we all know that. They're expensive, but there ain't nothing better. They're mouth-watering. So I thought, I'm going to get me a three-piece. It'll be expensive, but one time. And I was hungry. So I go in there, use the restroom, and order. And I get the three-piece fried chicken. Original, not extra crispy. Original. And I get the, you know, the, the full course meal. Mashed, mashed potatoes and gravy, you know, the whole nine yards. And I'm set, I sat down, I'm eating. And I'm thinking, now I'm so hungry, I'm eating a little too fast. I thought, hold on, I want to enjoy the chicken, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to eat these mashed potatoes and gravy first. That'll fill me up just a little bit. So I'll slow down on my speed of eating. I want to enjoy my chicken better. If you're eating too fast, you can't enjoy it. Because I was so hungry. So I, I eat all of the mashed, mashed potatoes and gravy. Then I go on my chicken. <laughs> it was delicious. Anyway, make a long story short. I finished my meal. I go in the restroom, wash my hands, clean up, and I leave. And when I, when I was eating the mashed potatoes and gravy, I noticed they seemed a little extra starchy. And I've always heard the rumor, they do whether it's legal or illegal, they do that so you won't eat, like at a buffet, so you won't eat as much. Now, I don't know, I can't remember. You know, this, I'm going back to 1991. I can't remember if I, 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 I ordered, but I can't remember. It seemed like they had a buffet. I can't quite remember that. But anyway, I've always heard that they uh, add a filler so you eat, like at an all, all you can eat buffet. They'll do that so you eat less. You know, sounds a little crooked. I guess you can't blame them because a lot of people will take advantage of that. I don't know if it's legal or illegal. Don't know. Anyway. But I know some mashed potatoes and gravy taste a little starchy. Anyway, I finished my meal. Left. About an hour later. Not food poisoning. I want to emphasize. Not, not, not food poisoning. No. My stomach started swelling up. You know that acid when I would belch? Tastes nothing but potatoes in that gravy. For four or five, five or six hours, it felt like a balloon slowly inflating inside my stomach. <laughs> so, uh, back then, to take my mind off of it, I went to the university huge library. Like three stories. It's open to the public. Even though it's College students still open to the play. And I went to inside the audio-visual. About a hundred TV sets. 
booths, you know, with wood partitions, booths. All you had to do is open to the public, just show your identification, and watch a movie. Bring your own, back then it was VHS, bring your own movie, or they have a selection. So I, it was hard, I was miserable watching the movie. After I did that, I decided to go look at books, get my mind off. Oh, my stomach was belching, belching, my stomach was swelled. It was, it was miserable. Okay. After five or six hours, I started feeling better. My stomach didn't feel as swelled. Well, about a week later, I decided to get on the bicycle. And something told me to ride down that way toward the KFC. When I got down there, I was not surprised, but I got a shocker. Every window in that restaurant was boarded up. The state closed them down. Plywood on every window. It was closed up out of business. <laughs> to this day, now the restrooms were clean. They always say go in the restroom. That shows the management. If they're clean or not. They were clean. I went in twice. Washed my hands before I ate. And when, uh, washed my greasy hands after, uh, after bef before I left. The restroom was clean, so to this day, I don't know if it was over cleaning this, I doubt it, or the, the meal was delicious. No food poisoning, just a swelled up feeling. You know, 1991, 30 years ago, 1991, that's been 30 years ago, 3-0, and I still don't know, I guess I could do a Google search on it. I don't know why they closed them down the state plywood over every window I'm sitting there and I'm looking at that store restaurant same thing and I actually said this out loud didn't answer myself but I said this holy hell I just ate there a week before <laughs> wow the meal was delicious but it swelled my I guess mashed potatoes and gravy swelled my stomach up horrible it's bad. no no throwing up feeling no nope. nothing like that just an acid swell you couldn't even throw up if I, I tried would not work just an acid blocked in swelled up feeling in my stomach <laughs> it felt like a balloon kept inflating inside my stomach yeah it was miserable I don't know what closed that KFC down, but the state boarded up all the windows. Wow.